Hey everybody and welcome to the Acne Channel or welcome back to the Acne Channel. My name is Brandon Marshall, one of the Banished Warriors here. Today I have a very special video for you guys. I kind of, this kind of came up because I've been watching some videos and stuff, just kind of doing some research as I do on like acne and different types of acne and things. And I feel like I've been hearing a lot of different like acne lies, like just things I feel like that aren't super true. So I kind of want to address some acne myths that I used to be told so many times that I kind of believe them, but now that I like know more about um, skin and acne and things, obviously I'm not a dermatologist, but there's just so many things that we're told about acne and our skin that's not necessarily true. So I wanted to go ahead and address a couple of those for you guys. So one of the very first ones that I'm going to go ahead and address is the fact that acne is caused by dirty skin. I don't know about you, but I know this is not true. I know lots of people that don't even wash their face and they have perfect skin. This it's seriously such a broad thing. Acne can be caused by so many different things, and usually dirty skin is not one of them. Um, it's usually going to be like your diet. Um, a lot of times it's genetics. Like I know that my brother also has acne, and it kind of can run in the family as well. I um, mean, it's also due to hormones. So there's just so many different factors that go into having acne. Some people seriously never wash their skin, might have dirty dirty skin all the time. It's just, that's just one of those myths I felt the need to address because I feel like I've grown up so many times hearing people like, why don't you just wash your face? If only it were that easy. Like, if you knew the amount of times I've washed my face or the different types of product I've used and I still am breaking out, like, it's not that easy. That's something that somebody with like perfectly clear skin would say that never has dealt with acne in their whole life. The next one is that only teenagers get acne. This is completely false. Um, I actually read some statistics online that said 64% of 20 year olds, so like anywhere from 20 to 30, suffer from adult acne. So like, that's a big population of people. Um, I mean, yes, teenagers do get acne as well. I kind of got mine later. I feel like I'm kind of a late bloomer, but that's probably why. And that had a lot to do with hormones as well and genetics on my end. But yes, um, a lot of people, believe it or not, will believe it because I'm sure you've seen it everywhere, 20 and up, definitely suffer from acne, even sometimes more than teenagers. It's kind of shocking, but not really. The third acne myth is something that I wish I would have knew a long time ago in my high school days is that the sun cures acne or whatever. The sun cures acne. That is completely false. What that does when you're tanning or whatever, it just camouflages your skin. So what I used to do because I was super insecure in high school and I had a lot of redness and things, so I would just tan, 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 which was in turn damaging my skin. And I was like, oh, it's helping my acne. But it really wasn't. It was just kind of hiding everything while also aging my skin because I was using tanning beds, which by now we all know that are not good for you at all. So that is one thing like, Yes, in the summer you might look tan and nice and camouflaged because I get really tan and you really can't tell that I have any redness or acne in the summertime, but it definitely does not cure or clear up your acne. Um, sometimes it might seem like it is helping a little bit, which it definitely can, but it's, it's in turn, it's, it's camouflaging. And I'm going to leave it on this one because this is one that I was told ever since I was young. Put some toothpaste on it. That is not the answer. I've heard so many people be like, oh, should I put toothpaste on my zit? No. It's, it's, it might seem like it's drying it up a little bit, but in turn, it's it's definitely not the best for your skin. There's so many different chemicals and things in it. There's so many other spot treatments that you can use other than toothpaste, so do not use toothpaste. Like, I have like my pumpkin enzyme mask, or even my activated charcoal mask, or I use the Mario Badescu drying lotion. Like, those are all really good spot treatments. Do not do the whole toothpaste clears up my zit thing, because it's, it's definitely not a thing. <laughs> so yeah, those were just four myths about acne. I know there are so many other ones. If there's any like myths that you have debunked or anything, definitely comment those down below and we can discuss those. All of my social media links will be down below. You can also use my code BRANDON10 if you guys want to check out the Banish website and any other products. And I will see you guys in the next video. Bye guys!